this video is a dual rotary example. The video covers how you can use multi-sensing systems and a dual rotary to acquire what would be uh, almost impossible application. This application is a uh, turbine blade uh, and uh, measuring the cooling hole location. These cooling holes are coming in at various angles to the surface. You'll see them here magnified in, uh, in a few minutes. But right now it's establishing a six-point nest with the test probe, which was, is required because it's, it is this uh, contoured surface that it needs to measure and lock in on the datum because there are no you know, geometries to use as a datum, so it uses a six-point nest. So it rotated around in two axes to probe the other side. That way it can lock in on a datum structure. So now you're seeing the measurement software in the background as well as the video down in the bottom. So the measurement software is measuring these hole locations at high magnification using a centroid target to determine the center of each of these holes. These holes are obviously supposed to be circular, but the, the manufacturing methodology limits the the roundness of it, so measuring the center locations with a centroid, uh, so an advanced centroid that uses threshold and technology and pattern recognition uh, to identify where these holes are. You can see down in the lower right that it's rotating in two axes, very small motions, but it's each of those holes are, are at a different location, different orientation to the surface. So they are all positioned at what's called gun barrel which means the center of the cylinder of the hole is uh, orthogonal with the optical path. So there it's moving two axes at the same time to get into a different set of holes. Low magnification, high magnification allows you to locate the holes roughly and then move up to high magnification to actually do the measurement. And this is all automated. This program was actually created from an NC file uh, as opposed to programming it from a CAD model or something. NC file was read to know the angle and uh, location of each of these holes so that it can rotate to that particular location.